Good morning. Welcome to the Ethereum Technologies Aerostation, where the sky is not the limit. My name is Julian Nigel, head engineer at Ascendium Tech. To fill you in on what's been happening, you've been assigned with fixing the turbine in the evaluation wing, which we've evacuated for safety reasons. You will have to navigate your way to the turbine, and I'll be monitoring you throughout your assignment. To make sure you're able enough to perform this task, please, orange is on the desk over there. Perfect. Now, exit the sleeping suite and proceed to the evaluation rooms. Evaluation rooms are filled with puzzles that involve cubes, buttons, and gravitational shifts, which I designed myself, and they are typically used for participants to test our new prototypes. For protocol reasons, I cannot override the exit doors, so you'll have to complete each evaluation to reach the turbine and complete the assignment. Explanations out of the way, please place the cube on the big green button to open the door. Great work! That wasn't too hard, was it? These next evaluations will require gravitational redirection. So we've left you with the official Aero Environmental Redistribution and Orbital Gravitational Repulsion Integration Platform, the Aero Grip. With this device, you'll be able to manipulate your gravity at will. Just fire at any gravitable surface, color-coded yellow, to redirect your gravity. Thank you. 
Welcome to the Ascendium Technologies Aerostation, where the sky is not the limit. My name is Julian Nigel, Head Engineer at Ascendium Tech. To fill you in on what's been happening, reasons, you will have to navigate your way to the turbine, and I'll be monitoring you throughout your assignment. To make sure you're able enough to perform this task, please, Pick up the bowl of oranges on the desk over there. Perfect. Now, exit the sleeping suite and proceed to the evaluation rooms. Evaluation rooms are filled with puzzles that involve cubes, buttons, and gravitational shifts, which I designed myself, and they are typically used for participants to test our new prototypes. For protocol reasons, I cannot override the exit doors, so you'll have to complete each evaluation to reach the turbine and complete the assignment. Explanations out of the way, please place the cube on the big green button to open the door. Great work! That wasn't too hard, was it? These next evaluations will require gravitational redirection. So we've left you with the official Aero Environmental Redistribution and Orbital Gravitational Repulsion Integration Platform, the Aero Grip. With this device, you will be able to manipulate your gravity at will. Just fire at any gravitable surface, color-coded yellow, to redirect your gravity.
at you go. Now you'll have to combine your extensive knowledge of cubes and buttons, along with the error grip, to solve this next evaluation. If you the cube's gravity, simply fire yourself at the desired gravity, then fire at a cube to have its gravity be set to your own. any gravitational redirection, so we probably should have introduced the error grip in the evaluations after this. But that's a problem for another day. Your only goal right now is to fix the turbine. from one of our collaborator companies from the surface. However, for legal reasons, I cannot mention them by name. To avoid confusion, I should probably let you know that exit signs signify the exit door to the evaluation. They don't actually show where the exit to the aero station is as that would suggest walking through them would be jumping 30,000 feet from the sky. Nice job. 
this next evaluation is actually part of a break room. Please, help yourself to any refreshments while you make your way through. of the Aero Station are still upgrading to the modern era, so those areas are closed off for the time being. You will have to detour through a more unconventional route.
this evaluation introduces a red cube and button variant. They, for the most part, act as normal, but red buttons can only be activated by red cubes.
looks like this door has malfunctioned. It's probably just a programming mistake. Try taking the cube off and putting it back on again? That didn't work? Okay, maybe try taking the cube off and back on again one more time? Why is this not opening? That puzzle should have worked perfectly fine. I quite honestly have no idea why it's not what. Greetings, I am the Terra, a safety protocol system whose goal is to protect the Earth from all kinds of evolutionary threats. This facility is labeled a threat to the environment because of its unregulated sky corrosion. Please prepare for landing soon. Oh, and remember, a clear sky means a healthier planet. <laughs>